Hello everyone, I'm Senor Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Hearts of Iron 4, playing as the Regional Defense Council of Aragon. So, right now, this isn't where we left off last time. At the end of the last episode, I told you I'd play this a little bit more off-screen, just so that I could find some way to expand at least a little bit. It's now, January 1941. It's literally 1941. Vichy France is here. Hungary is disgusting. Yugoslavia is gone. Lithuania somehow still exists. So, yeah, it's been definitely a while. And here are the casualties. I've lost 241,000. Quarter million. Versus 1.88 million. Now, the thing I noticed, they don't have a ton of divisions anymore. I want to say, I tabbed over. Tabbed over to see, and the AI, I think, uses, like forced attack so they just kept pu trying to pummel my lines and with extra attack and breakthrough but they ended up dying a lot so that's how I, I can push back out against the enemies they're still trying to attack me a little bit I'm still trying to, to attack them so this has been a little crazy look at my veterans I have a lot of veterans now I mean Jesus that's the AI man you gotta hand it to them. They love killing their own guys off. When you can try to defend. Also, I've been making a few more divisions. Let's see. Let's go over here. One, one. Garrisons, operations, whatever. Logistics. Uh, I've tried a couple attacks myself. Some of them weren't really successful. And that's why I still have an artillery deficit. Infantry equipment deficit. And we have a little bit of support equipment. So, it could be worse. I'm still, I still have to buy more infantry equipment because I still don't have enough. But, overall... We're doing okay now. We're definitely doing okay. But some of these divisions are still pretty darn strong. Hmm. Come on. Oh, you know what? You don't even go there. Just to help attack. Oh, and there goes Greece. So the Axis is looking pretty darn mighty. Yeah, that's a pretty strong Axis. And Vichy France, of course, isn't in the war, which is pretty normal. And I'm joined here with my Spanish anarchist kitty. Binky. Hmm. Right, Bink. That's right. Come on, please win here. Oh, they're attacking me once again. Oh, north. Oh, but we have some more political power. Still can't choose a national focus. Whatever. We do have seven, seven factories, though. Including three civilian factories. It's amazing. I'm going to go ahead and get some more war support, daily uh, support for online. And I guess some more political power. I mean, political power is great, but uh, yeah, whatever. Come on, guys. Please finish that off. I, they just threw another division in there, which really sucks. Whatever. Uh, could I win here? Probably not. Depending on... Oh, no, that division is really strong, so no, we can't. Um, yeah, I'm, I want to do attacks, but we kind of have to wait for our equipment to get up a little bit better. I'm researching radar, even though I won't ever be able to build it, probably. At least for a very, very, very long time. About to get more infantry equipment. Good, 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 good. And I was preparing an offensive in Burgos. Oh, we actually won. Nice. If I want to prepare another... For some reason, I can't prepare an offensive, like, in all these tiles next to me, but, you know, whatever. Uh, there'd be no point to plan an offensive here. We're not really connected to this area too much. Uh, I want to attack really badly, but... I don't know. Let's see what happens. Can you get down here? No, you can't. Fine, just hold. <clears throat> oh, Trubia A4. I do want tanks. I doubt I'll be able to get any. I really doubt it. We'll see what happens. Good. Five more infantry equipment. That'd be great. Beat these guys up. Centralized fire control. Awesome. More soft attack. Let's grab more recon. We'll go need some recon companies, which is fine. We have a little bit of infantry equipment, which is good. Need more artillery, of course. Can I make an encirclement anywhere? Using our normal infantry, I might be able to bust these guys down. Maybe not. Could be a 40 combat with division. Probably not. No. Probably not. Probably 20 combat with. I could probably go, come here. But we do have a bonus to Burgos right now. So let's keep that up. Oh, and let's take a quick look. So their strength is 38,000 and 61,000. So they're pretty much like us. They probably still have more manpower than us right now. But it's somewhat similar at least. Alright, let's get everyone in here so we can start an attack somewhere. Oh, let that division get out. Oh, he moved back. Up out down here. <clears throat> Up out of Burgos. Great. Good. 
You know what? You guys could probably do well without any help. Good. Continue the front for Burgos. Bilbao. Seven factories. Immediately attack here. You can probably use these two divisions as well. Throw in that pretty good infantry division. Take half you and help attack here too. And their organization is dropping. Beautiful. And they're still attacking me right there for some reason. Not sure why, that's okay. I kind of want to attack here, but whatever. Uh, reorganize this just a little bit. There you go. Since we have a, an offensive plan for Burgos, I'm going to keep doing it. Until when it, until it's over, which I don't know when. Come on, get a little more strength. Uh, just attack now. You guys can attack here. You guys take half of you guys. He's level 6. Cipriano Nobera. Awesome. We're going to throw another division in. But using these divisions, which actually... What are you guys? You're 20 combat width. You're pretty good. You're pretty standard, honestly. Which is awesome. Can I go straight for Burgos? Oh, I'm going to go straight for Burgos. Come on, 7 factories become something else. 9 factories. Ah, oh, nice. Awesome. Finally. More factories. We consider expanding up north and encircling these guys of Bilbao. So that you guys get more organized. Get to where you need to be. And then we're going to launch an attack. Right here. And then, take all but you, come that way. And we still have our Indo-Chinese volunteer there. Good. This so guy's gotta die. No time to die. Honestly, losing that tile isn't the most important thing. If we lose it, I don't really care. Because the most important thing that we could do right now is encircle and destroy these enemy divisions. That is the most important thing to do. Uh, don't even worry about it. I'm going to shift you guys over here to hold the line this way. Thank you. Come on. You know what? <clears throat> Excuse me. Help out. <clears throat> Very nice. Now we need Pamplon up so that they don't get any more supply. <clears throat> Stats. We need more artillery. Definitely, definitely, definitely need more artillery. I can make light tanks, but there's really no point for me to. Good. And at, once this war is over, we're really going to need to make sure that we have no resistance against us. Good. Oh, we have 11 factories. Look at that. 11 factories. Oh, my goodness. This is ins this is weird, having factories, finally. I'll take them out. They're, they're nothing. Good. Oh, look at that. An encirclement. Send the infantry with good artillery on them. Beautiful. Just, oh yeah. <clears throat> Roughly 2 million casualties. Just, my god. My god. Let's go ahead and reorganize the front line. Oh, they didn't like that. That's fine. I don't really care what they want. Uh, if I have to do an encirclement. Actually, it's, we might be able to do a general push now. Hmm. I know that their divisions down here are pretty strong. Even though I take Madrid, they'll still not be any closer to capitulation, really. So, oh, we only have one factory. It's probably because we have rebels or something. Maybe, maybe not. Yeah, we probably don't need this anymore. Keep trying to make that one military factory, please. Thank you, thank you. Uh, you guys hold for now. Uh, if you want to help attack, that's fine with me. I don't really care. Alright, infantry. Bust this way. Lead with the good infantry. You know, you guys come that way. I want someone to come that way, too. <clears throat> Encircle another division, please. If possible. And... Go ahead and start attacking them. Good. Burgos. Let's get that back. Should be there any day now. There you go. And it's cut off. Beautiful. Ah, more political power. Oh. I know we had all this stuff here. Infrastructure construction speed. Hmm. 
Well, army regrouping recovery rate isn't bad. I'd love to do that, but we can't. We already have more attack. Tank designer. Are there any decisions I can take? Impending Astios offensive. Ah, oh, let's get an offensive going down there. Stability would be a waste of time. Oh, yeah, more guns. That's always important. More, 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 more guns. Yeah, I definitely want to do an offensive down here. Um, yeah, let's attack that tile. Send the good guys down south. Oh, we're making some motorized too. Wow. Fancy. I don't want to try general offensive just because we don't have the, the you know, the equipment for it yet. <clears throat> How many divisions do they have? At most, 38. Which is definitely less than us, which is good. But then again, just because we we have a division doesn't mean it's really good. So, let's go ahead. Oh, they want to leave. Oh, yeah, leave. Go ahead and leave. Um, Material designers. Support equipment. Motorized. What do I want? Civilian factories? I mean, I'm going to need to build that stuff up, so... You know what? If you can, maybe go ahead and start trying to build one up in Catalonia, maybe? It takes forever to build. But we'll see what happens. Cool. Kill this guy off. And then without you, come down to... Uh, where is it? Outline there. Okay, I see it. Without you, come down to there. Without you, come down to there. And... Do something like that, yeah. Because I want to make sure we can take Valencia. That would be important. Good. Awesome. Oh, maybe I should have gone that way. Go and hold for now. Eh, go do that. Good. Hey, look, it circled. But most importantly, I need you guys to attack here first. So we can circle that division and destroy it. Oh, they maybe came in somewhere? Maybe, maybe not. Doesn't matter, kill them off. Alright, next one. Resource efficiency game might be really good to do. It is 1941. Can't do anything there. Oops. My finger just keeps going everywhere. Artillery upgrades. Let's, let's, do, let's do that. Oh, good. They're died. They're died? They're dead. And three divisions are going to go bye-bye. Boom. Done. A little bit more. Man, that's a pretty strong division. That's okay. So, you guys have done a great job. I'm going to continue doing this idea, though. And so go down to here. Let's see. Need more artillery. Guns are looking pretty good. Can we buy more, though? Because I will do a general offensive near the end here. Let's see. You guys come down here. Then you guys come down there. And then you guys come over to there. There you go. You know what? I don't even need to give them fourth stack. They'll be good anyways. But we do have 14 factories. Oh, even a dockyard. Even a dockyard. Yeah, build up a cruiser hull. That'll take until May 1942. There you go. There you go. Both of you come that way. Attack that way if you can. Any attack down there. That's okay. Two more divisions gone. Which will be great. Up attack here. Good. Now they're starting to run out of divisions to hold the line. Which is awesome. Come down there. I want to encircle both these guys. And he's almost there. Good. Good. And, uh, yeah. Don't take out Mercia. What are you doing? Ah, I see what you want. Oh, no, let's let, let's let that division move over again. Good, good, good. And then I'm going to do a general push after this. You can take this guy out. That'd be great. Good. Awesome. Pretty down here. Send the good infantry up with them. Can I get more guns? Yes, I can. Good. Alright, well. Let everyone get reorganized, and then we're going to do it. Then we'll do it an attack. Uh, if I plan for an offense, I can't even plan for an offensive now. For you guys, I want you to be careful. Go ahead. I want you guys to go crazy. There you go. Now let's try the general attack. It's pretty green. 
for the most part, except in the north, maybe the central portion. The south is definitely going to be okay. We have 16 factories. Great. Is there an impending attack? Or oh, preparing an offensive? Whatever. Construction 4. Um, resources. Engineering? No. Naval stuff? Get some better planes. Would probably be a good idea. Do we have any planes? We have zero interwar fighters, but we have a few, few naval bombers. What are you guys up to? Not much. Try to do southern Iberia, perhaps? Maybe? I don't know. Doesn't really matter to me. You guys should do generally okay. German Reich. Ah! Operation Barbarossa. Well, I hope the Soviets hold for a very long time. Because we need uh, um, them to hold. Because I don't want to deal with... Honestly, I don't want to deal with too many enemy na nations. I want the Germans to suffer so that I can maybe take out bitchy France sometime. Because... I'm kind of independent here. Uh, no one likes anarchists. I might go to war with Portugal. I'll probably go to war with Portugal. Let's be real here. Salazar, you're kind of hanging out by yourself. That's fine. Oh, buy more guns, yeah. These type of attacks take quite a bit of resources. Oh man, it's taking forever. Uh, you know a good way to just kill them off? Encircle them and destroy them. That's all you have to do. Division-wise, they have up to 33. Makes sense. Over 2 million casualties. Come on, get... God dang, you move incredibly slowly. Oh, Japan declared war on the Philippines, which declared war on the United States, probably. Lorenzo, you're level 4. Great, almost becoming level 5. Madrid is a frontline city. Good. Uh oh. Wait, what happened here? What, what? Convoys. Are we training for something? Oh. Oh, that's right. Eh, we don't need that. I'm so sorry, convoys. But you're going to die. Oh no, convoys. I don't want to rest these ships. Uh, especially since they're supposed to be repairing, but they're not. Oh. That's why. Hey, look, an encirclement. Pretty normal stuff for me. No. No, no, no. You're not going to beat these guys up. They're going to beat you up. Gotta kill that division off. Good, good, good. Just go that way. That'd be fine. Get a little bit more strength back. Can we buy more guns yet? Nope, that's okay. Madrid should be ours soon-ish. No, yeah, maybe not. Maybe not. Forward observers. I need some recon companies. Let's get some armored car stuff. Stuff like that. Oh, my goodness, it takes forever to kill these guys off. Let's go ahead and stop the attacks. Because while they're doing okay... Redeploy the front line. Thank you. We're going to put you guys here so we can cut off the southern portion of Spain off. Wow, look at that manpower. We get our core manpower back. We get so much more population. So good. All right, so tell me the losses. Not that bad, actually. Not that bad. Yeah, not really not that bad. Oh, boy. We just lost that. They're still pretty strong in some, some areas. I mean, it helps that they have 20 combat with divisions for themselves. So, All right, you guys are almost there. Improved artillery upgrade number two. We're going to wait on that one. Tanks are coming along. Naval stuff. Plane stuff. Let's focus a little bit more on plane stuff. That'd be good. We're going to focus on the south here. Uh, don't worry about that right now. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about attacking. Alright. Alright, let's kill off southern... The rest of southern Spain. You guys should have absolutely no problem with that. Oh, wait. We're still trying to fight from Madrid, huh? Alright, cool. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, to Madrid. Great. Oh, they're pretty close to capitulation. Nice. That's only a slightly brutal civil war, you know? I mean, what? Only... I don't know. How many people died? Over 3 million? <laughs> only 3 million people died so far in the civil war. That's all. A casual 3 million. Gotta pump those numbers up. Okay, let all these guys move around a little bit more. Uh, make sure we try to take the, the bases, the naval bases. Oh, there's... Oh, actually, no. You guys should focus up here. I need to condense these guys into something smaller. Like, so that my four infantry divisions can hold these guys here pretty easily. Actually, you know what? You guys come here. You come here. And prepare this division to attack. Or this division, doesn't really matter. Good. Awesome. And then do that. Cut Sevilla off. Let these guys... Eh, they still have... 
ports. Actually, if I can just completely surround Seville, that sounds like fun. Let's do that. Let's completely surround Seville. You guys probably won't be able to... Well, maybe you'll be able to win. I don't know. You guys attack that way. I want all four of you guys here, because I want everyone else to focus on the north. Because I'm going to completely encircle Seville. That's the plan. Awesome. Nice job. Move in. Move in. Even though then... Then again, if I just capture Seville, they'll probably just die. Good. Come on, guys. You got this. Oh, actually. Move in. That division's pretty strong. Come on, guys. Hurry up. Pound them harder. Good. Immediately start attacking that way. Because your goal is to get that port. Because once we have that port, it's all good. We got it. Honestly, if I had to take Seville, it might be enough to capitulate the entire nation. So, that's what we're going to do. I only need four divisions. I'll just go ahead. Just go ahead. <clears throat> if it doesn't capitulate the entire nation, then oh well. Whatever. At this point, I think we've pretty much won. There you go. Are they dead? Are you kidding me? They're not dead yet? Oh, they're so close. They're so close. Actually, oopsie. Oh. Portuguese anarchism. What does this do? Huh. Our war for freedom has spilled over the Portuguese border and the government is being destabilized. With the proper support, it is not unthinkable a full-scale anarchist uprising might occur within their borders. We must light this flame. Yeah, let's do it anyways. Yeah, let's do that. That sounds like fun. God dang, I was really hoping that I could just smash national Spain here, but I guess Seville really isn't worth very much. That's really disappointing, but whatever. Uh, you guys... Hispano, that's good. Let's see, anything else? Get some more fuel. We're gonna need more fuel eventually. We got anything else here? Oh, yeah, fighters. Oh, we're actually making quite a few fighters. That's actually really good. But I could use more of this right now. We could use way more aluminum, though. Encircle that division, destroy it. <clears throat> and once we do that, I'm gonna... Cause battle attacks. Good. Attack, attack, attack. Go ahead. Yeah, the war is pretty much over at this point. Japan demands French into China. No one cares. I mean, except for the French. But then again, the French don't really have really much of a say. All right. Japan is doing really well against China. Holy cow. Really, really well. The U.S. joined the U.K., which... Hmm. I don't know if you want to join the U.K. Maybe the Allies. Maybe, maybe not the U.K. Well, so the Germans are pushing in a little bit. The war started in July, so it's been a few months. This is... Not as good as you might have hoped. And we have won the Civil War! Finally! Finally! We have done it. Oh, look at all the divisions we lose. Recovering from Civil War. Oh, my goodness. After a long and grueling Civil War, Spanish anarchists have finally defeated their Republican and nationalist enemies and secured full control over Spain. Though isolated pockets of nationalist troops continue to wage guerrilla war that may well hamper the formation of peaceful communes in previously nationalist areas, it is unlikely further coordinated resistance of any significance will materialize. As the various communes focus on rebuilding their war-torn villages, towns, cities, and industry, they've elected, elected to remain organized under their wartime regional defense council, apparently in response to increasingly hostile rhetoric and various world leaders' reactions to the anarchist victory. And I lose a lot of divisions. Ooh. But I made another one, so it's kind of okay. You guys are, you know, just pretty much infantry, and so you guys are okay. You all are the normal 20 combat width infantry. Uh, I want to convert everyone to uh, that type of division. Not bad. Uh, I'm definitely going to need more divisions, though, now. Just throw them on there for now. You were just made. This is the division that we really want. Good. Oh, we made another one. Oh, another uh, regular one. We have plenty of artillery right now, so that's actually okay. Wow, look at... Oh, my goodness. Look at that. That's actually really awesome. How many divisions does Portugal have? That's a very good question to ask. 
Hydroelectric power. Oh, you know what? Spanish Workers Intelligence Agency. Uh, let's, let's, let's form the department. We have 28 factories. <gasps> A whole 28 factories. And only our industry is hurt. Or our infrastructure. Wow, we have one. Oh, that's not good. Oh, and what about ships? Oh, we got the ships. Finally, we got the ships in return. When the Civil War ends, you get your ships back. Something like that. You guys join them. Uh, That's actually not a bad thing. It's not too bad. You guys come up here, too. That's not too bad. Uh, let everyone come down here, actually, because it's a bigger port. That's pretty good. The subs are over there. That's not too bad. Not too bad, not too bad. We're still repairing a couple ships, which is fine. And we want to finish up this focus. I don't know what it's going to do with us. Do for us. Oh, that's going to be removed in five years? Jesus. Oh, and how is... Oh, how is resistance? I definitely need this spy here. Hold on. Let's double check resistance. It's definitely increasing. So, we're using the... This division. Division de Calabaria. To help garrison stuff. Hmm. Hmm. Use default to division. So it's this one. That's actually not too bad. I'd need military police probably for this. 20, 20 suppression isn't bad, actually. That's a core. Uh, actually... Is this not a core? Uh, it's an occupied state. So their resistance is definitely going to be going up, 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 up. So... Oh, goodness, yeah. In the nationalist places. let us We have to get rid of this. They're not going to really comply with us. So, we're going to go with martial... Oh, Ireland joined the Allies. Martial laws, perhaps? That might be necessary. Or it won't help us at all. 5.3, 5.5. 5. Yeah, it's not going to help. Actually, that doesn't help resistance at all. 6%. And they have a cap of what? At, from negative to 10%. The compliance is needed. Compliance growth, 0 0.026. Alright, well, that could be worse. That gets up to 10% max, so that's not too bad. Former department, good. Now, I want to use the rest of these civilian factories to actually build up my country. That'd be pretty good. Let's see. Root out resistance. Where do we want to root out resistance in? Uh, there's three places up here we could do. There's four. Let's do four. That's the most we can get right now. Let's do that. 7.7. 7.9. Even after we have our spy there trying to root out resistance. That's uh, that's uh, kind of qu questionable. Not going to lie. Hmm... You know, in any case, if they want to do it like that, then that's kind of a waste. Let's just figure out what Portugal's up to. Oh, let's cipher do that one. Oh, it takes so long. It won't even probably even matter. Oh, uh, war propaganda. Oh, we have stability. What the heck? That seems very odd. Why do we have stability? Ah, Portuguese anarchism. Very nice. Um, uh, I need full. Con Wait, do I need to manually go to war with them? I might have to manually go to war with them. It's not cool. Oh, railways, factory repair speed. We get more infrastructure. Torchbearers of tomorrow. So, I guess we have to do this one next. So, the Spanish community as a whole must be rallied in a single great drive to repair the damage resulting from a violent civil war. Our factories must be rebuilt so that people can return to work, and new infrastructure must be constructed to facilitate interaction between local communities. Also, how do we get down to this one? Requires this, so we have to go to war with Portugal. Oh, and I can actually get that stuff as cores. That's kind of cool. We need collective recovery efforts to do this, to get down to it. Faith in the cause. Honestly, I don't need that much more war support, to be frank with you. So, and divisions. They have a thousand manpower, so that doesn't really matter. Uh, this might not be a good idea, but it might be a good idea. I don't know. 
Someone tanks. Oh, Portuguese anarchism. Uh-oh. Ever since Aragonese anarchist fighting spilled over the Portuguese border, local anarchist supporters have flocked to our cause. With some well-planned and executed encouragement, pro-anarchist sentiment has spread like wildfire among the younger members of Portuguese society. As a result of the transfer of Aragonese anarchist weapon caches to these Portuguese anarchist cells, the situation in Portugal has escalated to the point where the government is suppressing a full-blown uprising. The leaders of this uprising have now requested our more official direct aid, proposing that we take the lead in the global anarchist struggle and suggesting that they join us more formally once the fighting subsides. 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 Maximus Portugal declare war on Portugal. Sure. Yeah. That was easy. Um, just go straight for Lisbon, I guess. Give them a little force attack. They should do really well. Wow. Come over here and help out in southern Iberia. Great. Um, I guess help attack. I mean, how many divisions they have? It did help that, um, oh, they have the same flag. That they, you guys rebelled and took, like, two divisions away from them. So, and I've just taken Lisbon. Awesome. I'll let you guys go and do whatever you need to do as well. And we've cut them off. The south should fall pretty, pretty darn easily. Until Beja becomes a capital. Hey, we got a puppet, though. This is... I don't know what this side of the focus tree is like, though, to be honest with you. Or, you know, what happens after the Civil War. Ah! Civil War ends! With a favorable con conclusion of this Portuguese anarchist portion of our anarchist struggle, the Portuguese anarchist cells now request to be welcomed into the Defense Council. And I annex them! Wow. That was... Relatively easy. Oh, and we got their divisions, too. Oh, God. Four combat. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Four combat with. Oh, my goodness. Let's just go ahead and convert you to this. And put you under him. There you go. Now train. Oh, do we get their ship? Oh, were they 51 ships? Holy crud. That's a ton of ships. They're not good at all. <laughs> They're not really good at all whatsoever, but, you know, that's okay. That's okay. Uh, subs. Submarinos. Good. Um, give me half of you guys. You know what? I'm not, don't even give me half. Give me like, there you go. I want a lot of screens for these ships. I'll probably need them. I want, I can probably make anarchists rise up and Vichy France. How is this? This war is not going very well for Germany at all. That's really good to see. Regional Defense Council of Iberia. Let's get some tanks going too. I'm not sure where to put you, to be honest. But I would go there. Oh, wait. Do we get... Oh, we got Northern Spain. Northern Spain. That's Africa. Northern Africa. Little portions of Africa here and there. <gasps> oh. Oh, that's so cool. We got down here as well. Uh, they're rebelling. No. Good. Is that a core of ours? No, it's just an occupied state. Oh, besides garrisons. Make sure we have enough gear. Oh, goodness. Uh, before I delete these guys... Eh, I don't really care. I mean, our divisions are already pretty good. So let's get rid of this. Uh, armor divisions, I might want to keep that. You guys, what do we want to do with you guys? We have decisions, institute press censorship, no, that's okay. Military, dockyard, construction stuff. Industry, what do we need? We want tanks. So I'm going to go do that, it's already 1941, it's fine. What happens if I go to war with France? Oh. They're justifying against Vichy France. Oh, they're guaranteed by... Oh, that makes sense. They have up to 44 divisions? Wow. Now, I want to get through this as fast as possible so that we can go with the Regional Defense Council of Iberia so it can become a little better. Oh, and I do need some military police. Don't forget that. We got a lot of guns, finally. Light tanks? Awesome. Do that for now, because I want to try to get a few more things of planes going. Nice. Awesome. Let's go ahead and maybe trade away one thing of aluminum. Perhaps. Just one. It's not much. It's just one. That'll be good. And Legendaris Bulgaria joined the war. We're trying to build up Catalonia. And actually, none of our infrastructure has been hit in Catalonia, which is good. Uh, you guys can trade as well. Uh, you might as well try to become better. Actually... Oh, there we go. It has that shift button. Plop, plop. There we go. Good. 
how is the war going? Bet oh, happy 1942, everyone. What's the war like? Oh, hold on. Ciphers. We need a cipher. Um. Bet you France, because why not? Ah, the United Mexican States joined the Allies. Ooh. And I'll end the episode relatively soonish. Good. 1942. Research. German Luxembourg War. So the Germans, the Axis has lost 2.25 million. Italy's lost a lot. Holy cow. The Japanese have lost too much. The Allies have lost a lot, though. Let's see what happens about that. The German Mongolian War. That's a lot of losses already. Yeah, the Soviets, they're not doing too bad. The Germans, we're probably going to join the Allies. If we. Well, no, no, we're not. No one likes us. Uh, just remember, no one likes us. Which is fine. Um, you guys. Defending against subversive attacks. Oh, resistance is still popping up here. Yeah, do as much of Lisbon as you possibly can until I can core all this territory. Uh, is there a cap for this? Martial law, that's good. Martial law. Oh, Portugal, you... Oh, you're capped at 12%. Probably. Oh, no, it's going down. Oh, no, it's going back up. Compliance is at 4%. All right. Liberia joined the Allies. Watch out, guys. Liberia has joined the Allies. Catalonian Free Republic. Ah, there we go. And now we shall do this one. With the liberation of what was once Portugal, we may establish a new defense council that re represents the wishes of all communes existing in the Iberian Peninsula. But unfortunately, my friends, that is all the time that I currently have for today. So if you enjoyed today's episode, because we've done really well here, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you all tomorrow as we continue to struggle and move forward with the effects of the Spanish Civil War. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great rest of your day.